Here I'm asked to solve an exponential equation. There's a number of ways to do this, but what I notice is that 16 is a perfect power of 2 and 64 is a perfect power of 2. So what I'm going to do here is write 16 as 2 to the 4th. Now remember, 2 to the 4th, we're raising that 16 to the x minus 1 power. 64 can be written as 2 to the 6th power. Okay, if I simplify a little bit, I'll have 2 to the 4 times x minus 1 power equals 2 to the 6th power. So notice I was able to rewrite the exponential expressions on both sides of the equal with the same base, 2. When that's the case, you can use the one-to-one -one property for exponential functions and equate the exponents. So here, the only way this can be true is if the exponents are equal. So 4 times x minus 1 has to equal 6. And what's left here is a simple linear equation. So we could solve this. Okay, adding 4 to both sides, I'll get 4x equals 10, or x equals 10 fourths. Uh, simplifying, that's just 5 halves. Okay, so the solution here is uh, 5 halves or 2 and a half. And you can actually plug that into the original and see that it really does work.